Hi, today we're going to do some text capture and I'm going to take that text capture and play with it when we get to the editor by adding it to a picture so we can make a background. Here we are on the web page that I want to capture and here's the text right in this area that I want to capture. I'm going to go to my capture screen and make sure that I am in text capture mode, which I am. And I can see here I'm in all-in-one in output, which um, that's fine for me because then I can I can choose my region or window and it gives me more options if I'm all-in-one because that also includes the scrolling page so I could capture the whole, all the text on the page if I'd liked as well. My output, I've got it chosen to file because in my properties I have set up a specific text file that I want this to go to in my folder so each time I take a capture it saves there. And I like I like to keep that. Um, I like it to ask for a file name so then I can name each file individually. And I like to anno annotate my captures and add notes if I like. So that's okay for me. I'm going to go here to my layout. I like to remove the blank lines and collapse the columns. If you wanted to figure out more information about the columns here, um, if it was a columned uh, page that you were taking, you could delimit that using these different um, selections. I'm just going to choose the layout and remove the blank lines. And then I also down here I have caption selected. Um, <laughs> is this my caption? You know, I want to I want to see what this turns out to look like and I'm going to put my computer name, my username and my time and date because why not use all the features? I'll say okay and when I'm ready to capture I just hit the capture button. Here we are in text capture mode, I'm going to select a region of the site. The only thing that the Snagit will capture is the text. When I let go of the mouse, it gives me my caption option saying my name, the time, and the date. That's fine with me. My caption I want to write is uh, Great Plants from Annie's Annuals great place to shop for plants. Okay, and here we are in the editor. And here's my text. You can see here's my caption. Here's my annotation that I added. And here's here's the plants that I chose. I just want so I'm going to get rid of this. I can select it and delete. I'm going to select this and delete. Select this and delete. And just select this part. And I'm going to copy this because I want to come over here to my little sprout and add it to my sprout. So I'm going to enlarge the canvas of my sprout. I will add a text box here and then I'm going to paste that text by pressing Control V. And it's as simple as that to add text from a capture that you've taken to another photograph. I hope this helps you in completing your challenge with the text capture tool. Have a great day.